Hello friends, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this video, let us discuss about the last data structure called a hash of complex record. This record is a hash having array of arrays, hash of arrays, array of hashes and hash of hashes. Now let us see a detailed example on how to access the values inside this complex record. In this program, I have created a hash of complex record. It is having a key where a value is a hash reference. Inside this hash reference, there are four key value pairs. First is a simple key value pair. Second is a key value pair such that value is an array reference. Third is a key value pair such that value is an array reference containing hash references. Fourth is a key value pair. This is nothing but a hash of hashes. Now let us access the value tutor. Hash name and give the key name here. As the value is a hash reference, you have to use an arrow symbol followed by the key name to access the value tutor. Let us test it. This is how you access the value tutor. Now to access the values inside this array reference. For that you just need to replace name key with skills. If you try to test this, you will get an array reference. In order to get the values inside this array reference, dereference it. This is how you can get the array reference values. Now let us access the key value pairs inside this array reference. For this, I am going to create a hash object. First of all, try to get this array reference. To get this array reference, hash name followed by the key name. As this is a hash reference, use an arrow mark followed by the key name level. But this will be an array reference. So you have to dereference it. Use at the rate dollar for each on this hash object. Create a hash inside to assign the hashes. For each on the keys of this hash followed by printing the key value pairs. This is how you can access the key value pairs. Now let us access the key value pairs in this hash of hashes. For this Replace the hash object with percentile and replace level with details. Now the whole thing has to get dereferences. For each on the keys of this hash object. followed by printing the key value pairs. This is how you can access the key value pairs inside the hash of hashes.